This world is a tiresome world. Many people have money, yet they say I am tired. Many people are in business, yet they say I am tired. Many people have received fame and love in this world, yet they say I am tired. Man will not rest until he has gained what he desires in this world. Because of the heavy burdens we put on ourselves, we dare not allow ourselves to rest. We would be satisfied if we could lighten our workload so that our tiredness and anxieties could also be reduced. But let me tell you something. The Lord Jesus can give us not only a lighter workload, but absolute rest. He causes everything to stop. Do you know what rest really means? Real rest means to stop all of our working. We do not have rest because we have been suffering from the heavy burden and entanglement of sin. You must realize that the Lord Jesus wants you to come to Him and have rest. In fact, you do not have to do anything to have this rest. As much as we enjoy rest, we always think that we have to do some good work before God so that we can earn His rest. You may think that God hates you and that you must work hard to please Him. But the Lord Jesus says that there is no need to work. He calls people to come to Him not to work but to rest. This is the real gospel. God is calling us today, come to me all who toil and are burdened and I will give you rest. The Lord has already borne our sins and accomplished redemption for us so that we can freely come to Him. Whoever is willing may come. No sinner can work to obtain rest by himself. But if you simply come before the Lord, you can obtain rest. You can pray this way, O oh Lord Jesus, this world is really a tiresome world full of toils and burdens. But Lord, you have called the weary people, saying, Come to me, all who toil and are burdened, and I will give you rest. What a gospel! Lord Jesus, you are not only calling me to work, but to have absolute rest. Lord, I come to you now. Give me the rest in you that I so desperately need.